What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. And today, we're going to be taking on Wisconsin. Wisconsin started this year off in the top 25. Lost to Fresno State. Lost to Penn State. Lost to Washington. This team is 0 and three is it the same dominant team on the ground i mean possibly okay they have dominic doherty he seems to be pretty good in three games 420 yards but they're missing the guard who's 87 overall i'm not quite sure if he's even a starter because usually this o-line is beasting and feasting early in the year but so far hasn't been that way but wisconsin historically has given us fits they have been the upset in our thorn it's been heartbreak hotel upset city I'm hoping that that's not the case today, you feel me. That pass play is going to result in a first down for Wisconsin. Parker with good hands like all state makes the catch right there. Now Jefferson fakes it, throws it to, turn, to Turner, and Turner gets upfield with a nice completion gain of nine from the 45. Jefferson dropping back the pass in this big Hayward. One of our defensive linemen is out for the season. Hayward has come in nicely and has applied some pressure in the early going. That's going to be caught by the big tailback, Dominic Doherty, and that's going to lead to a first down. So they're going to go to the air with Brandon Jefferson. That pass will fall in complete, just overthrowing everybody. Second down and 10 to give it to Dominic Doherty, and that pass, or that run play, will pick up four. Garcia with the stop. Sometimes we'll go with the three safety look with two strong safeties and our free safety. Swoops is there to bat that thing away. They will get three, so we are down three nothing. Rodney Smith, he's going to get the carry. If we can get our ground game going, that would be a pleasant surprise. Going to run the ball with Smith again. Going to pick up a first down. That's first down and 10. Run the ball with RJ Larkins, and he gets close to the first down marker. He's going to be a couple of feet shy. So let's run that Wildcat option with Meyer, and that's going to lead to a first down move, those Shanks. Courtney Johnson back in that quarterback, looking down the field to Jason Miller, who brings it in. And our offense of attack is definitely led by our passing game. Show and prove right there. We're going to run the ball, pick up just two. Going to fake the run, looking downfield as Johnson throws it to the back of the end zone, caught by Walker, the 5-6 Goblin. He gets up in the for six, tack on the PAT, and we are up seven, two, three. Dominic Doherty gonna break one tackle. He's gonna get thrown to the turf at the 20 yard line. First down and 10. They give it to him again, and he's gonna take it north and south. And again, Wisconsin's ground game is pretty solid, but is it enough to let them actually force an upset? First down and 10 after they pick for first down, broken play, and Henry, he is there. To wrap the quarterback up for a four-yard loss. Toss play now. And there goes McNamara in your backfield. Stopping you at the line of scrimmage. Jefferson throwing it downfield. Nearly intercepted by Greenwood. We will take the incompletion. We'll take the football right back. Rodney Smith up the gut for a gain of two. Going to go to the air. Courtney Johnson looking downfield. Drops it off to the tight end. But that pass will be broken up. So third down and eight. Looking for Isaiah Stewart, who brings it in, takes a major hit, but hangs on to the football and gives the Hoosiers a first and 10. And then Wisconsin defense gets some pressure and forces the incompletion. Blair to the outside is going to get bottled up and thrown down. So the Hoosiers going to go back to the air, rolling out as Courtney Johnson. Land the fly and it's going to be caught by Jason Miller. And we're going to be inside the 20 to end the first quarter. First down and 10 from the Wisconsin 13. Quick pass to Willis. And Big Patrick Willis is in the end zone. And we're up 14 to 3. Doherty trying to turn the corner. And he does. Gets brought down by Stewart. Picks up a gain of 8. Now they're going to be up to the 28-yard line. Second down and 2. They give him the ball again. And he's going to get punished. The real Mike will put hands on him. Now they fire in the traffic. is tipped. And then intercepted by Henry. Henry appears to be a little bit shaken up. Ref, get off of my player like that. So first down and 10. John Blair gets the carry. And Blair's going to weave through traffic, and that's going to result in a first down. On first down. Quick pass to the right side. Caught by Jason Miller. Got brought down up high. It's a five-yard face mask. And it's going to be first down and two. Quick pass to the left side. Caught by Walker. And we're up to the five-yard line just like that. First and goal from the five. Under some pressure, they're going to rule it at incompletion. Thank you for the tuck rule. We're going to run the ball with Smith, and we're going backwards. 
So now we're looking at third down and goal from the eight yard line. Johnson throws it into some traffic. That pass will be broken up by Powell. And now we have to settle for a field goal. The kick is up and the kick is good. So we increase our lead yet again. And now they're having trouble on the kick return. They finally get the football, and they're going to get dropped at the two-yard line. When it rains, it pours, and it is pouring here in Wisconsin. They're going to run the ball with Larson. The big fullback goes nowhere. Battle gets a bender for the stop. He had nine tackles last game. They're going to run the ball with him again, or this time they're going to give it to Parker on the end around. Gain of maybe one. Doherty trying to get the first down on the ground. He breaks one tackle, and he's going to have it. We were unable to bottle him up, and that's going to result in a first down. And now Doherty trying to get through traffic. Not going to happen as Hayward is there for the stop. From the 18 now, second down and nine. Frazier, he gets to Doherty, and he's going to bring him down. Setting up third down and fourth from the Wisconsin 23-yard line. Quick pass. Doherty has it. He's going to get tripped up by Houston, but Dominique Doherty has himself a first down. Now Jefferson, quick pass, intercepted by Houston. Houston inside the 20, Houston inside the 10. He can walk home from there. Touchdown, a 34-yard INT to the house. And now we're up 24 to 3. Looking downfield is Brandon Jefferson, and that's going to be intercepted by Frazier. Give me that Yahoo, Zay Hurt. I said give me that Yahoo. Give me that user interception, and we got this thing going back the other way. So we run the ball with John Blair. We're going to pick up six. Looking towards the end zone. Caught by Miller. And he's going to get across the goal line. And now Indiana is up 31-3. to three. So a 28-point deficit. Can Wisconsin get back in this one? And Parker is going to drop that pass. It would have been a big first down. Maybe even a touchdown. That pass going to be caught by Freeman. Gain of nine. Third and inches from the 35. They're going to run the ball with less than a minute on the clock. And they're going to pick up the first down and burn their first timeout of the first half. From the 37, quick pass to Allen. He has good hands like Allstate, makes the catch, gain of eight. From the 45, they hit us with a play fake, throwing it downfield, caught by Parker. And now they're up to the Indiana 35 yard line. They hurry up back to the line of scrimmage. Play fake going the other way. They throw it to Turner and the big tight end showing some soft hands in traffic. Now Brandon Jefferson proving to be hot. Throws a strike to the end zone. Caught by Allen. And Wisconsin gets on the board to end the first half. So 31 to 10 is the score. We're going to take over to kick off the second half of play. We're going to get that ball to RJ Larkins. And we're proving to have some horses in the stable at least for this game. Our ground game has been pretty solid, pretty consistent. Throwing it deep is Johnson. Throwing it to Isaiah Stewart, who is loose and gets dropped inside the 25. Caught by the shoelace, so that would have been a touchdown. Rodney Smith up the gut, picks up four from the 17. Second down and six. Johnson, under some pressure, throws that one away. So third down and six from the 17. Throwing it McCoy's way, and the big tight end makes the catch inside the Wisconsin five. First and goal, halfback option, and RJ's going to keep it, and RJ has himself a touchdown. So 38 to 10 is the score. Wisconsin's back down by 28 points. They still got some time, but they got to score quickly, and I don't know if they're built for that kind of comeback. Doherty's going to pick up a couple. Third down and seven. Brandon Jefferson throws it back the other way. He's going to get broken up, and his receiver's going to pay the price. And we take over after forcing a three and out. John Blair to the outside. And he's going to get upfield and he's going to have a first down. This freshman tailback's looking pretty good. We got two of those guys. Hopefully they can turn out to be studs. Moving forward as Rodney Smith fumbles the football. That's our first turnover of the ball game. They hit us with a play fake and we bit on it. And Turner is in the end zone with a touchdown on the replay. You can see our safety and our linebacker both bit up. And they're both supposed to be covering the tight end. That's not a good result. Last time I checked. So they kick the ball out of bounds. We take over from 35. And there goes John Blair again. Gets all the way up to the 45-yard line in Wisconsin Territory. And just like that, we're on the other side of the 50. R.J. Larkin picks up a gain of two. Johnson throwing it. Caught by Miller. Not enough for the first down. So third and inches from the 35. They give to number 25, who is loose. And he's going to pick up the first down. 
Johnson gives it to Larkins, makes two Wisconsin badges look absolutely silly. Breaking their ankles and breaking some hearts, that pass will fall incomplete, dropped by Patrick. Second down and 10, Meyer looking downfield. No, he's just going to tuck it in. I'm joking. You know when he's in the game, you know what time it is. And the defense still can't stop it. Now we can get the ball to RJ who can't quite get into the end zone. And Andy Jenkins is a little bit shaken up. Second down to go from the one yard line. Give to RJ again. Not going to quite get in the end zone. So third down and go from the one. Johnson under some pressure gets away. Still buying time. Now he's going to keep it. He's going to get into the end zone or pocket pass a guy. Just a pinch. Just a little sprinkle. Just a little dash of, of, of athleticism. And he can get the job done for you. Second down and four. And there goes Stewart on the D line. Giving it to your tail back in the backfield. Now Jefferson going to throw that thing deep. And that pass will fall incomplete. And our defense forces another three and out. So we have Walker waiting for the punt, just shy of the 30, gets the ball, gets upfield quickly, but then drop, and he drops the ball. It's on the ground and picked up by Richardson. Inside the 10, inside the 5, and that's going to be a scoop and score for the Wisconsin special teams. So we're up by 21 now. We get the ball to RJ. He gets beat up in the backfield to end the third quarter. So we got the ball, we got the lead, we can take some time off the clock and handle Benz. We should be just fine, but Smith fumbles it again. Conception is there for the recovery. And again, with Smith struggling, that's going to open up the door for maybe a freshman tailback to take the reins. But RJ gets blasted, and he's short the first down. So, Indiana, we go three and out. Quick pass it outside, and that pass falls incomplete. And the Boo Birds, from the, play, from the people who are still left, is, is raining down. That pass will fall incomplete, and some more Boo Birds. Third down and ten. Brandon Jefferson lets him fly for the third straight. Time is tipped. And an interceptor by McNamara. I don't know how that ball got to him. And that's going to be our second pick six of the ball game. Our defense is flat out filthy. Hempfield now in the ball game. He's going to throw it. That pass is going to be broken up. And again, they're booing. We have all of our backups in our defense. They're going to run the ball with Larson. We're going to throw him down. Third down and six now. Hempfield going to throw the ball deep. Perfect pass to Williams. And here comes Wisconsin from the 46-yard line. Hempfield throws it. That pass nearly intercepted. Was that Nichols, I believe it was. Now they're going to run the ball with Doherty and Justice. He gets up in the delivering Justice at the line of scrimmage. Hempfield looking downfield. Throws the ball deep. And it's going to be caught by Williams. Straight Mawson, folks. And that's going to result in the first down and 10. They fake it. Hemphill looking to the corner. The end zone intercepted by Keys up to the 10. Spin move at the 15 and dropped at the 16-yard line. And even our backups are making a statement. Now Dan Adams in that quarterback. Looking for Isaiah Stewart with a diving catch at the 31. You make it the 30-yard line. Now we're going to run the ball with R.J. Larkins. And again, he takes a nasty hit. Second down and seven. Give it to him again. He runs a man over. Still on his feet. And it takes two to bring him down. So third down on five, Adams looking downfield, throws it, and that pass was a little bit too hot as it came out and just overthrew everybody, including their mama. Now there goes Doherty back there, and he's loose. He's about to go untouched. All the way inside the 30, sprinting inside the 20, and racing as he high steps inside the 10 to the goal line. So last game, we had some trouble recovering the onside kick. Today, it is no problem as R.J. Larkins is there for the recovery. Going to run the ball with Lewis, our backup fullback, and he gets back to the line of scrimmage. Make that negative one. We're going to run the ball with our QB, and that's going to go backwards as well. Now our backup tight end is a little bit shaken up. That's not a good look. So third down and 11, play fake. Adams looking downfield, throws it, and yeah, we look <laughs> kind of out of sorts with our backups in. So him, Phil, he throws it, going to find Freeman, and Freeman is going to pick up the first down move those chains. From the 32-yard line, Hemphill fires in. That pass could have been intercepted, but Nichols is just going to bat that thing away. And then there's a false start. All the booing is too loud for the Wisconsin O-line. Now Hemphill looking downfield, throws it into a, a group of Hoosiers, and that pass will fall incomplete as well. So third down and 15. Hemphill under pressure, and down he goes. And that is going to do it for the ball game. 52-31 to 31 is the final. And ladies and gentlemen, I think this team has 
finally arrived. Um, I remember, I think it was season two, we beat, we beat Purdue. No, we beat Iowa. It's kind of the same colors. But we beat Iowa. But then we would go on to lose to Wisconsin the very next week. And Iowa was ranked number one in the nation. So Wisconsin has always, always been that team that has given us some trouble. But their ground attack, even though it was better than our passing game, wasn't as good as in years past. We already beat Ohio State. We do not have a game versus Michigan this season, I believe. I, I, don't, I don't believe we play Michigan. Maybe we do. But from what I remember, we do not. So all signs lead to another Big Ten title. But if our rank keeps on going up there, it could be a national championship season. And that is what we are hoping for, ladies and gentlemen. And we're trying to win multiple national championships here. Multiple Big Ten titles, obviously. Win the Big Ten for multiple seasons in a row. And then probably move on. But I'm excited to see what this Hoosier team can do. I'm excited for our younger players like Dan Adams. I want to see how he blossoms. I want to see which running back, which young running back, John Blair, RJ uh, Larkins, which one of those guys are going to step up. I want to see. So anyways, that's going to do it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope that the rest of the day is the best day. Peace, love. Hot sauce.